Hello you gorgeous people of the interwebs, I hope you're having a fun dabby dozy day. Welcome to my channel, or welcome back to my channel. I am Gwenny, and I love luxury in all of its glorious forms. And today I've got a cheeky little high-low double unboxing for you. Yes, I've got a double unboxing today. It is a cheeky little double unboxing i will let you know that these are both coin purses this one i bought for myself in the sale after looking at for a very long time and this one is one that hubby bought for me on a complete whim but before we get into the boxes please do show the videos you like on my channel the thumbs up love hit the subscribe button and ring my bell so you'll be notified when i upload new videos every monday and thursday and also don't forget to follow me on instagram i've called this the high low luxury unboxing because although this is the more affordable option i do still consider this a luxury let's have a look so there's a little pouch here you can tell this isn't a true unboxing It's a little bee! Please excuse the state of my fingers. I have just painted my nails and we all know how terrible I am at painting my nails. Now this is the little coin purse, alphabet coin purse from John Lewis. And this was originally 25 pounds and we picked it up in the sale, or Hubby picked it up in the sale for me for 12 pounds 50. It's got the B on the front. It's plain on the back. It's got three card slots. A little leather tab in there that says John Lewis and Partners and it's got a pink bee on it with a pink matching little wristlet strap mm, no not quite a wristlet strap first off hubby saw the G for Gwenny and um, although the colour is really really nice it's this kind of petrol kind of cornflower blue with the similar sort of mustard colour of my Louis Vuitton epi leather sack triangle on it so a really nice color combination and would have looked great with that we decided that we were going to go for the b and the b is my surname it is just so cute it's pink it's pink and the gray color is so nice and warm uh, this reminds me a lot of a warm gray that i've been looking at at aspinall i'm always looking at something aren't i i think we all are so this is really, really, really cute. Now I could use this as a full coin purse, a full wallet. It's not quite big enough to put a unfolded 20 in there, possibly an unfolded 10. This is the first piece. Now I'm trying really hard not to overdo the SLGs. I have a load that I don't currently use and I'm probably going to sell in my vlog sale whenever that happens. Um, but what I wanted to do was make sure I had different things that served different purposes not the same thing over and over and over again i've got card holders i don't need more card holders i used my louis vuitton reverse monogram card holder once i didn't enjoy it that much so i went straight back to my gucci so this is the first item i will leave details in the description down below and a link so you can go and check it out for yourself i will also pop the details on screen so you can hit pause and have a little read if you would like Also, this smells really, really good. It is full leather and at full price of £25, it really is a bargain already, but half price, £12.50, very nice. And if I'm not using this as a full wallet, I can use it as a mini, mini, mini to my mini pochette accessoire and keep things in there that I feel I must have on me at all times in bags that I can't fit my mini pochette accessoire in. Things like headache pills, Rennie's, a lady product, that kind of stuff. And this is the big one and this is the true unboxing and this I have been looking at uh, for myself and for hubby actually since my birthday in 2019 for my extravagant extravagant birthday never to be repeated never ridiculous not unless we win the lottery anyway here we go whoops so there we've got the paperwork oh that feels 
really nice. I don't know if you can see that's textured beautifully. It feels very luxurious. And I like how they've cushioned it around in the box to make sure it fits with the uh, folded tissue paper. Very nice. Pop that down over there. Oh look, can we see? There we go, because we can see you. First spotted it in the men's section and he was like, oh yeah, I don't quite like that. And I was like, okay. Just got him into a card holder and I was going to get it for him for our anniversary last year, but things went sideways before then and we decided we weren't going to do anniversary presents. And the more I thought about it, the more I thought, I want one of them for me. So here we go. Mm -hmm. Lovely little dust bag. Oh, I love Samurai. Just look at that dust bag. Heavy duty, double lined, and what I went for is the Saint Laurent Fragments Zipped Coin Pouch, and this is in the colour Lipstick Fuchsia. <gasps> this also smells marvellous. So what's it got on the tag? Tags must remain attached for exchanges or returns. Got the little bit of blue covering on the uh, on the zip pull. You've got the lovely Saint Laurent Paris debossing. I don't want to knacker it or anything by pulling too hard, but there's the product code or serial number. I'll, I'll try and check that out and match that up to the product code. What do you think? I think they look quite cute together, actually. Instead of having my coin purse card holder and my mini pochette accessoire, could potentially just be carrying these two little babies around with me. So again, 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 I have SLGs that I do not use on a regular basis. What I like to do is pretty much the same as my jewellery, earrings, necklace, bracelets and things, get in it, stay in it for a few months at a time. And that's what I intend to do with this one and potentially this one. I don't like to overstuff this. I don't like to put folded notes in the middle because they're folded and because they're that kind of funny plasticky, nylony, whatever it is they're made of these days. They tend to push out and I don't want to overfill the card slots here. So one, two, three, four, five. So I've got five card slots in here and then if I need to carry any extra cards, I can put them in the zipped up bit along with a little bit of cash. So this one was £12.50 reduced from £25 and this one I got for £130 reduced from £190. I went back on the website to have a look at some of the details for this. I will pop those up on the screen so you can hit pause and read them at your leisure. I will also link it down below. And although the link is still active, this shade, this lipstick fuchsia, which let's face it is my colour, is now out of stock. So. I think I'm going to go and have a little play with these off camera, no peeking. I'll let you know what I think of them after I've used them both. So what do you think? Cute or non? Which style do you prefer? Straight up pouch with a couple of card slots in it or card slots on the outside with a little bit of a pouch attached to it? Let me know in the comments section down below. So that is all for today's video. Let me know what you think of them in the comments section down below. I'll see you for the next video in the meantime. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and ring my bell. Stay safe, stay happy, be kind to yourselves, be kind to others, stay fan dozy and bye bye.